briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In a real estate fraud case that set a precedent, appellant Leo E. Kingston Jr. was held accountable for making false statements on HUD forms in 1992. Based out of Oklahoma City, Kingston was the sole proprietor of Leo E. Kingston Investments, a company that purchased and sold real estate in the surrounding area. Many of these transactions involved financing by HUD or the VA. In a twist, he then shifted the finance properties over to another company, ENS Investments, which he and his wife had set up. The intricate scheme unraveled when Kingston was charged with concealing that sellers were not the true owners and didn't receive the proceeds from the transactions. Challenging his convictions, Kingston made several appeals on variegated grounds. He contested the district court's decision to admit testimonial evidence regarding telephone records, arguing they lacked proper authentication. Furthermore, he alleged violations of his rights and claimed that the evidence against him was not substantial enough. However, the United States Court of Appeals rejected his appeals unanimously, seeing no reversible error in the district court's decisions. They concluded that sufficient evidence had been presented supporting Kingston's guilt beyond a reasonable doubt. Furthermore, they found no impropriety in the admission of testimonies pertaining to phone record information. In a decisive judgment that reinforced federal law, the court upheld Kingston's sentencing and convictions. They judged that the district court had appropriately handled evidence and applied the law, adding significant weight to Kingston's convictions. Convicting Kingston, the ruling emphasized the need for more than just circumstantial evidence for a conviction. There must be sufficient evidence to support a rational jury's finding of guilt beyond a reasonable doubt. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit LSE.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.